Hey, this is Jordan Secchi on our Washington, D.C. radio studios. As you know, this week we have been working very hard to save the life of a Christian pastor sentenced to death by hanging in Iran. We are working with his attorney. We are working in the media. We are working at the United Nations, just around the world. But I wanted to give you a glimpse of how much media, just television-wise, of course we do the radio as well, but television-wise, both I did and my dad this week just to help save this pastor's life. A pastor in Iran once again makes a stand for Christ. Youssef Nadarkhani faces execution within days. The American Center for Law and Justice is working to help free Pastor Youssef. Can you save his life? Uh, we're working on it, Bill. He has been a Christian. He's a pastor of an evangelical church, technically under Sharia law. He did not even violate it. The lower court has authorization from the Supreme Court uh, to carry out the execution at any time. So there is no appeal process here. Mm -hmm. There is no real court system. They can carry out the execution. That still stands. It has not been overturned yet. They can carry out the execution before we get a written order. They're going to try to use him as an example. This is not over just with the death sentence. This is about securing his release. That's what we're fighting for here. The more news, the better, because it keeps the focus on that courthouse. The White House statement was big news, international news. But unfortunately, Bill, we saw from Secretary of State Clinton a one sentence statement today, but she didn't expressly call for his release, which means the international news won't be able to quote our Secretary of State, our top diplomat, as calling for the release of this pastor. Again, we're on the front lines of this issue. It's late in the game, but if U.S. pressure can be put on, the Secretary of State's office needs to be a lot more affirmative than they've been on this situation. Of course, the U.N. is saying nothing. You know, folks, that is just a sample of one week in the media at the ACLJ. I want your support. We need your support. There's a Donate Now button in this email, and I encourage you to make a donation, if you can, today to the American Center for Law and Justice. Thank you so much. You're the reason why we're able to do so much work for so many different clients and on so many issues here in the United States and around the world.